Hey, what's going on guys? This is Chuck, it's Chris Will with Simply Vegas Realtor out here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Let that wind die down a little bit. Alright, here we go. Now I'm sure you guys can hear me a little bit better. So, like I was saying, uh, today we're going to be taking a tour um, with this model. This model is actually called the Raven. And the developer is Richmond America Homes. We are in the Summerlin area, Master Plan community. And this community is actually called the Cliffs, which is located on the south side of Summerlin and this uh, neighborhood is actually called Onyx Point and the Raven actually features a 3,350 square feet of living space here is the suite or casita as you can call it whatever you want to call it oh I do love those windows oh, I'm loving the cabinets Oh, look at these cabinets. Oh, these are some solid cabinets. Loving the cabinets. Three quarter. Shower. Love the tile work all the way up to the top. The only thing is that it's gonna be hard to scrub that type of tile. Also, the other thing is that if you don't have a soft water, then, oof, it's going to be pretty tough. Oh, look at the uh, texture on this, guys. I'm loving that texture. It's like that plastic look. Oh, also I have uh, three panel sliding glass doors. I like that. It's nice. Now, the Raven features a three bedrooms, two and a half, and three car garage. And it does have that optional casita, which we'll Oh, look at Take a walk back around this way again. And I do like the fact that you can open this up. That looks like the dining area. All right. And you can open the casita side up. So, so it's just one big living area. Kind of get the best of both worlds right there. Oh, I love the doors with the glass. Brings in definitely a lot of light here. Wow, look at the open floor plan. Love that. We're gonna start on this side though. The office here. Office looks to be about 12 by 12. I do like the built-in. Love in the ceilings with the crown. And you got your French doors. Loving the uh, tile work. You got a 10 inch baseboard, bull nose. Off to the left here. It looks like you have half bath. This right here is just storage. Coming into the laundry room. We love the fact that there's a sink. Let's see if these cabinets are actually soft shuts as well. Nope, these cabinets are not soft shuts. Those ones are. Uh, 
a lot of space definitely for folding your clothes. I like the fact that you can do that. This right here is the sales office, so we're not gonna go in there. But technically that's supposed to be the garage, the three car garage. Well, I think that was a two car garage and the Casita was actually an optional third car, but I would definitely make it a, a Casita. So I'm sure that this one's actually a three bedroom plus the Casita as far as options. You got some granite. Loving the uh, light fixtures there. Coming into the tub shower combo. You got cast iron tub. That's like a really good tub. Loving the tile work. Toilet. Beautiful bathroom. I do like the, uh, the tile. So it looks like you have an area to store some stuff. Oh, that's cool. There's the first bedroom. Ceiling looks to be about 10 feet. Doors are eight feet with four hinges. That's a plus. Closet looks to be about eight by two feet deep. Standard closet. I'm sure it comes standard with the uh, rocker switch. Also what I'm gonna do <clears throat> as well is within the link in the description below, I will actually have uh, a link for the feature of this property as far as what comes with it, especially at the uh, asking price. And the asking price for the Raven actually starts off at uh, 675,000 dollars starting. Closet's not that big, it's probably a four by six. And this room's only 10 by 12. There's your air filters. Come into the master suite. I do like the fact that there's a sink, a little wine chiller. Put your soda there. You have your 44 uppers with the crown. Coming straight ahead. Actually be your closet. Closet looks to be about eight by 10. Let's go into the master bath. Whoa, check that out. Loving this. Now, this is actually very utilized space. I mean, look at this. You have your tub, right? Then you have your transition, so the water will actually run down here, right? But then you have all this light that comes in, right? And look at this, you have his and hers to take a shower. Look at this rainbow, rainbow. <laughs> Look at this rainfall fixture. Loving that. Well, I do love the tile work that goes throughout. Look at the uh, transition. So you have the same type of tile on the backsplash all the way. It's really nice. Let's take a look at the quality cabinets. Pretty decent. Coming into the master closet. The second one. Let's see here. Look, look at the tile work on here. These are porcelain tile. Right here is just your toilet. Nothing fancy about that. Oh, look at the crown on that. Didn't even notice that. Also, I wanted to mention to you guys that if you guys don't have a realtor, 
definitely like the opportunity to earn your business, that's for sure. Especially if you're buying a new home. Just get you a lot better deal than you negotiating it yourself. And I'm not asking for your business. I'm looking to earn your business. I want to earn it. Oh, check, check this out. Wow, look at the crown on that. This is not called a drop ceiling. There's another name for it, but I just don't remember. If you guys know what it's called, let me know. This bedroom is fairly large, 25 by 30 it looks like. I love this bedroom. The uh, carpets, two inch pad as well, feels really good. Let's take a walk down here. Let's take a look at the main part of the house and see what it really has to offer. So here's your formal kitchen. I mean, um, dining area. This looks to be about 15 by 12. Man, the ceilings here are even higher. Look at the ceilings on there. Probably 12 feet ceilings. You have your four panel sliding glass door. It is not a pocket door, so do not be misled. I prefer to have a pocket door so that way you can utilize more space. Look at this, you have two dining areas. And I love the windows, you have so much light that's just coming in here. So much light. Look at that, you even have that sliding glass door. That's a pretty wide sliding glass door right there. Wow, I'm loving that. That see through, the only thing is that if you're a messy person, it definitely is not gonna work. Double stacked. I like how the fact that you have your butler's pantry right here. Nice. Here's your pantry. Pantry is about four feet. By 10 feet. Beautiful girl. I thought these type of sinks were outdated already, but I guess they're back in style. You have your beautiful island. This looks like more of a cult culture marble type waterfall. This home does definitely have that modern feeling to it. However, it kind of reminds me of um, kind of a country, warm, homey feeling. I don't, I don't have the name for it, so if you guys know what it's called, the style, let me know. Also, if you guys haven't subscribed to this channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Let's go outside. It is a little bit windy, so bear with me. You see that? Yes. Wow. Look how high the ceilings are out here in the patio area. There's only 75 lots for sale in this new development. 13 of them have already sold. They're about a quarter of an acre per lot. So you're going to have a pretty big, decent sized lot. Over here uh, is an elementary school, I believe it's called Shelby. Also over there, um, you have the water park, Wet n Wild. Look how huge this lot is. Huge. Let me get a little bit more of the uh, exterior. Right there is the uh, pool pump. 
Uh, it's not a heated pool. Beautiful pool though. Also the pool's got Pebble Tech, looks like. And come off to the side here. You have two air conditioning, split units. Goodman, I'm sure it's all 13 sear. As you can see, we are nestled on the mountain's cliff side. It's a beautiful home. Asset price is uh, starting price, which is the base price, six seventy-five. Wondered uh, if this is actually worth it. If this is something you guys would actually pay. Now there are a couple dues. And fees that come with a home in this area. One of the fees is a mass plan fee, which is a Summerlin fee. Now Summerlin actually has 22,000 acres of development land from the Howard Hughes Corporation. So that master plan fee is a total of $46 a month. I heard they're gonna raise it to 48. Also one of the things that, another fee that they have is just for this community, which is the Onyx Point because it is a gated community. That's going to be $115. That's actually not that bad. Uh, one of the fees that, or actually the cost that comes with this home is actually SIDS and LIDS. SIDS and LIDS are $25,000, believe it or not. And it's kind of high. So basically, if you're starting off at six seventy-five, dollars you're really starting off at seven, seven dollars $700,000. However, the good news is that um, we can definitely negotiate that, so keep that in mind as well. It's not a big deal. Also, if you have not subscribed to this channel, please subscribe to this channel. We're about to hit 6,000 subscribers, and I appreciate every single one of you that have been subscribing to uh, our channel, that had to subscribe to our channel. I really, really do appreciate it. And uh, let me know what you guys think about this property. I'm Chuck, it's Chris Want, realtor out here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now I'm with Simply Vegas. And have a blessed day.